Hey everyone, Will here from Mature Minded Gamers, and today we're going to be taking a look at Super Fantasy Brawl. Oh my goodness, this box is absolutely huge from Mythic Games. I'm going to butcher the name, but I'm going to I'm going to try it anyway. I think it says Johan Eisenhuth. I hope I said that right. Apologize if I didn't, but man, oh man, I love this game. Now, the reason I already know I love this game because I have been playing this on Tabletopia for quite some time. I even did some videos on each of the characters as the, the cards stood at that point. Now, I'm hoping maybe some of those cards have been revamped and changed a little bit, but we will see. So, first off, this box art looks gorgeous. The box is huge. I love the black and white of the characters in the background here. I love the splash of the symbol in the front, the logo there. This is two to four players, although I think it's, in my opinion, it's primarily more of a just a two player game. Like I said before, the box is just insanely large. Now they're having conversations online about how there's a bunch of space wasted in this box, but Let's take a look at what is on the back. The only thing I've done so far is I have removed the cellophane. So that way we don't hear the crinkling sound and everything. Let's get a much better shot at some of these characters and such. There we go. Wow. Wow. Now they do not come painted like that. But man, I'm, oh, I can't wait to get my, my paint on with these characters. So again, you play this on Tabletopia. Two to four players, 30 to 40 minutes, ages 14 and up. It says, welcome to the land of Fabulosa, the land of the ultimate form of entertainment, the brawl. Who is the best champion of all times? Come and see for yourself. Summoned by wizards, the greatest fighters in history battle in the hope of entering the annual supreme competition, the Super Brawl. Oh, goodness gracious. That art, I love it absolutely love it the artist who did these this, this art for this game and the character design just everything is just fantastic all right so let's take a look at what is in this gargantuan box here let's go ahead and zoom on out here get a good view of everything all right so let's dive right in to the super fantasy brawl. All right, enough of the theatrics. All right, we got the rule book. Okay, we've kind of seen this online. It's already in PDF format. You can download this right to your phone or what have you. I doubt much has really changed too much from their last iteration that's on Tabletopia. Okay, game round, player turn. Some examples, some skills, leveling up, hex and hex rows, four player variant. So again, this is a four player variant, not just a four player game. So it's got a variant afterthought. We have keywords over here, some more key keywords on the back, as well as a nice little index down there as well. Okay, <clears throat> so let's, let's go ahead and tackle this. I'm so excited. I got a blue tray here. <clears throat> All right, a lot of wasted space. I can already tell. I, they didn't have to make them that thick, or as far as that deep. Okay, well, let's take this off here. Take a look at the characters. All right. Kilgore is awesome. Wow, I love that. That detail, the miniature is big and bulky. I mean, I got big hands and this guy is here. Absolutely impressive. I love it. Look at the detail on the base and everything. You can kind of get in there and see that. It'd be an awesome paint. Next up, we got Darren. Let's see if we can get that zoomed. There we go. Focused a little bit for y'all. Amazing. Okay, awesome. Loving it so far. Wow. That's just 
Man. Killer. Absolutely killer. <clears throat> All right, so... One of the things that I kind of noticed here on the trays themselves, they've got little logos that kind of gives you an idea of which character actually goes in which spots, which is pretty nice. Same thing over here. <laughs> you guys, I've seen this one painted up quite a few times. Sushao. Oh my God. I hope I can paint it as good as what I'm seeing online, but man, absolutely gorgeous. Oh, yes. Look at that. The chain. I was worried about this chain being brittle and stuff. But oh, that's solid. That is solid. Plastic. Real nice, hard plastic. And I'm giving that a little bit of bend. That's not going anywhere. Digging it. Okay. Man. A little space in there for Dwayne's figure there. Beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. All right. Moving right along. One more tray deep here. Duck rotten. Oh, ho, ho. I love that. Man. This video probably doesn't do this figure justice. Absolutely gorgeous. there too beautiful it's just gonna look so good painted up all right let's see what else we got here <sighs> that sword oh my so beautiful and insane It's gonna look really good painted up. Really good painted up. The amount of figures in this box is actually really good, seeing as you only play with three at a time, and the composition of your army is really gonna make the game change every time. Plus, the when the I mean, you don't know exactly which of the objectives is going to pop up next. Hmm. Superb. All right, what is next here? We've got, let's go ahead and dive into the trends here. Not too bad. We've got a big hole down the bottom, so we're not just solid plastic. Some good weight to them. Now I did get to to hold some of these at the uh, at Gen Con uh, 2019. Pretty pretty nice. Okay, really. Got a whole insert for one. are so awesome man i do dig them 100 dig them absolutely all right what is in these red cases here we've got the challenge cards okay got a whole 
bunch of them there. Now, the deck of cards. Gold dog right on top. Okay. And this, one of this side's going to hold cards, and you got extra for, for sleeved and everything. Now, I did, I backed the the bag as well so i went ahead and bought that thing i'm hoping that you know we talked about this extra space and everything i'm kind of hoping these all kind of fit inside there pretty nice and get rid of this massive box first player marker that's some really light i'd love to see that in metal oh that's slick and stuff. Alright. Okay. Get your activation tokens flat on one side, imaged on the other, got red. More victory point markers. <laughs> Those are cool. I dig that. All right, so in the box, you get a pile and pile of cards. You get the character cards. You get a leveled up side here. They also have six cards, two in each color of the cards and the abilities for each of them. Uh, I'm going to do a video that's going to go through each of these characters, just kind of like all in one shot and talk to you about each of these cards individually. Uh, so I'm going to link that in the description below. So be sure to check that out. Um, I am also going to be in that same video talking about the challenge deck. Uh, just keeping in mind, in the core set, you get two sets because essentially, if you bought the player mat, you have two sets minus doubles of the characters where uh, up to four people can play um, with the two boards. So, really cool there. All right, so moving on to the components here of the punch boards. Not bad, not bad at all. Nice and thick, easy to punch. Okay. Nice. Got options whether you want to use those components. Okay. Got the player boards here. Nice thick cardboard. And of course, you've got the actual board itself, which is pretty large actually. Nice and big. On the back side, it does have a nice design to it, which I think is really cool that they did that. Now, one of the things that I did spring for, which I'm sure most people did, is actually the neoprene mat. It is actually almost the same size as the board itself. So nice quality mat. Does the job really well. And I also went ahead and got just the mat kit that has the player mats as well. So that was the component breakdown and the unboxing for Super Fantasy Brawl. Again, lots of space, lots of room to grow. I really don't know if I'm going to be using these trays or not. I think they're just a little bit too, we've got so much wasted space here and they could have made the box just a little bit slimmer. So, all right, everyone, thanks for watching. Be sure to check out all of our other great content on matureminedgamers.com. Don't forget to hit that like and subscribe button. And until next time, everyone, be safe. Take care.